If we're talking about what's offensive and what's inhumane, I mean, almost all media did show the videos uh, or clips of the kneeling journalists and others who've been executed by IS without pixelating their faces. And is there anything in more, more inhumane than showing uh, in, seconds before a person is executed to the world at large, you know, uh, someone's uh, husband, someone's son uh, about to be executed? I mean, where's the humanity in that? <laughs> I mean, you're asking a very difficult question, and I freely admit that, but I'm, um, I'm not to... Where is the humanity in that? Okay, what is the role of a, a news organisation? Is it to tell their readers things which are uncomfortable and which, uh, um, and which may be difficult? I mean, I think there are countervailing um, um, arguments in this. I'm, I'm not trying to defend it. I mean, I think... In the I'm trying to defend the need sometimes to offend to uh, and to publish. And I, and I do think that that's important. But I don't think that freedom of speech should be made the excuse to publish every last vile, gratuitous image of violence just to get a few more clicks on your site or sell a few more newspapers or, or get a few more viewers. And it's, it's, there's a point at which you make judgments about that, and that's the really difficult stuff. So um, uh, I think that, and we don't, and I think the other thing is news organisations sh should be open about not always getting it right. And you may do something on one occasion, and then you, after that you may think about it and you may regret it. Do you know what? I think we went too far in the heat of the moment. Yeah, and I think we should also take the discussion into, you know, it's part of freedom of speech for these media organizations to decide not to publish. That's also free of speech, you know. They're free to decide if they want to publish or not. I think the, the argument about, you know, if you don't publish, then you're against free of speech is completely, um, you know, false in, in, in its own, um, um, you know, merits. <laughs>